Since February 1940, when I became Commandant of the Women's Royal Naval Service, I have been able to visit a number of ports where units of the Wrens are employed. I had always heard what a wonderful spirit of friendship existed throughout the organization. As a result of my visits, I know this was no exaggeration, and I also know why. Wren officers are promoted from the ranks, and so they understand the conditions of life and work among the ratings with whom they have to deal. I should like to say a word of congratulation to the many thousands of Wrens who are already serving their country. We are very proud of the wonderful way in which you have carried out your work during air raids and at times of tension. We admire your courage and we know that danger is met unflinchingly because the future happiness of our families and homes depends on victory. I feel sure that there are still many women who would like to do their bit by serving the Royal Navy, the traditional service of the Empire.